racing away from the 1400 metre marker. I'm a vision is right there shortly after the start. Luna tied with a good position but is a little bit strong. Recall Dawn is among the leading group. Madame Butterfly on the outside with She's a Joe. That's the red cap. They'll follow it further back in the field by Miss Midas. And then Queen Diva, that's got the white earmuffs near the rail. Dusk Beauty's alongside. Miss Ferris gives them about seven or eight length start as they go to the 900 meter marker. They are followed by Aries, who gives them about eight or nine length start. They're about to commence the turn with 700 meters to go. Footspur is about eight or nine lengths off the lead, and then comes Electra Diva. About to turn into the home stretch, and the leader is Aries. So it's Aries by a length leader. In second position is She's a Joe. Down the inside, Luna Tide. And then comes Queen Diva. That's got the white earmuffs down the inside, Miss Ferris. They're followed by She's a Joe. Miss Midas is on the outside. Getting to the 300, and Aries still leads it. Queen Diva down the inside, then Luna Tide, Miss Midas running on, but it's still Aries as they get to the last 200 meters, and Aries is going on strongly, Aries is going to win it, so Aries will win, the second placing's close, Queen Diva got up for second, close Miss Ferris, and then Miss Midas. Number four, Aries, the winner, Daryl Daniels, the daughter of Argonauts for the Cotsons, and Judy Wintel, who also bred. And number four goes off at eight rand, the win, 170 the place. So nice for Daryl Daniels. There's a salute on number four, Aries. The second position, run it across, goes to number three, Queen Diva, beaten about four or five lengths. Third position is Miss Midas. And then behind that one was Miss Ferris. Liberty Market is further back, and then came Luna Tide. They were followed by Recall Dawn and Electro Diva. So Aries is the leader and continues to go. She's a Joe down the inside, Queen Diva, and towards the outside, Miss Midas. Uh, that victory goes to the daughter of Argonaut, and that's Aries. Until the running of race five, back to the studio. Number four, Aries has bounced back after a good second to Soldier's Bride last time out. She's kept up the momentum. And you must be pleased with the progress she's shown after that last run? Yeah, she, she's a nice filly. I think last time it was just unlucky, you know. Actually, the horse who beat me was a horse to beat for, uh, for, for Mrs. Wendy, you know. Yeah. Now, looking at the race today, she seemed to keep up that momentum. Yeah, I told uh, Dora Daniels, she's a fairly, she's a little bit hot, as you can see. I tell him, I said, listen, you know the fairly, I'm just a little bit worried with the draw. I like, you go to the front, if there's one horse in front of you, you get a cover. If there's nothing coming, and then you go. These are the type of horses that you've got to do the work back home, and you leave it to the jockey in the race. Yeah, sure, like I said, I think he's got another couple of races to win, you know. Well done, keeping the flag flying with the string you got. Yeah, thanks very much. Uh, to shout out to Mr. Kutsin in Cape Town, and uh, good luck to the owner, uh, Mrs. Wintel. Uh, good luck to Dara Daniels. I ride a very brilliant job with this horse. Keep up the hard work, Lunga. Thanks, my brother. Let's get Daryl Daniels into the picture. He's going to sneak in and coming back with a bang. Yeah, take us through. We believe that she can be a bit hot. Yeah, look, um, before we go anywhere, I just got to say thank you to God for getting me back here. Um, I'll get back to thanking the others just now. She's a hot filly. I hack her down. Um, she's got a big action. The, the game's firm. And I said to Lunga, from that draw, I'm not going to fight with her. If she wants to lead or sit second, it's fine. Going around the turn, a little bit green on the bend. I don't know, green or just taking the nonsense out of me. But um, balanced up and she quickened up good. It's hot out there. She's sweating. You know, I'd have liked to have taken it a bit easier, but I didn't know what was coming up behind me or not, so I gave her a hard ride. And I don't think it's the end yet. Well done to Glenn. 
good training by Lunga, Mr. and Mrs. Wintel, thank you. And then just to say thank you to the guys at Wayne. They've uh, become a big family to me. Craig and uh, Janet Falconer, head of the house, the head, the heads of the house, uh, all the guys down there in Wayne. They're all doing a sterling job and it's, it's a nice, big, solid family. And I love going back there every day. Best of luck. Thank you. Daryl Daniels bringing home number four, Aries, the daughter of Argonaut for the Wintels, the Glen Cotson team in the number one box.